The death of dropshipping is approaching. I'm sorry to say this, but if you're doing dropshipping with the traditional ways in 2023 and moving forward, you're almost guaranteed to fail. But thankfully, there's still hope. Hello everyone, Joshua Carter here. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new around here, please hit the like button on the video. It really helps out the channel. And subscribe if you haven't already with bell notifications on as we are posting weekly content and you wanna make sure you're getting notified. So make sure you hit that bell. And without any further ado, I don't like wasting time. So let's dive in on why dropshipping is dead. Now, this is a phrase I've heard countless times. I get a lot of people ask me, Josh, is dropshipping dead? Josh, can you still do dropshipping in 2023? The answer is yes but it's dead from the old ways. Now, how I define the old ways of dropshipping is by number one, using AliExpress, number two, using supplies with terrible product quality, and number three, products that have long shipping times that don't even get to your customer. If not, don't even have any tracking numbers, you don't even track if they actually get the product or not. That form of dropshipping is dead. You could chalk up you know, a website with some little mediocre ads and make some sales, but it just does not work in 2023 and moving forward because the customers are more advanced. They are you know, aware of scams, they're aware of this. You know, The trust is a lot harder to build, but if you can build trust and your marketing's right, you can make a lot of money. And I can say that from experience, crushing over six figures online before the age of 18. I'm 18 now and always crushing every single day. And the best thing is about dropshipping is that it can never be saturated. Now, people say to me as well, like, is dropshipping oversaturated? Dropshipping is dangerous. No, it's not. The products that you sell, they can get saturated, they can die out, I 100% agree. But the business model is never going to be dead. And why the business model is never gonna be dead is because buying and selling is never going away. People and businesses are always gonna buy their product for a lot less and sell it for a lot higher. This business model is never going to be dead, it's just your limiting belief of yours that you think it's gonna be dead. And especially the way we do it at Elite Ecom Academy is on eBay. Now you've probably been seeing on Instagram, on TikTok, on YouTube, online that Shopify dropshipping is good. And in my opinion, I hate it. And if you guys wanna learn a bit more about eBay dropshipping, you can just click up the other videos here on how to do it with actually zero dollars. You can watch that video, definitely recommend it. And um, also if you wanna get one-on-one -on -one support from me, click the first link in the description, book a one-on-one -on -one call with me, and we can even talk about it further for free. And now another thing I wanna to touch base on with eBay dropshipping is that, like I said, you don't need to build a website, you don't need to spend money on ads, a domain name, you don't need any of this, any of these ads, none of that. Saves you a ton of money. And that's why another reason dropshipping is not gonna be dead is number one, picking the right dropshipping niche. Because we've got people that do Amazon dropshipping, Shopify dropshipping, Etsy dropshipping, eBay dropshipping. Your business model could be dead if you don't pick the right one. Now do bear in mind, all of these work but it's the barrier to entry that's gonna hold your success back. For example, on Shopify, a lot of saturation. You're gonna to have to have a really good website. You're gonna to have to have the best marketing. There's a lot more costs involved with Amazon. But with eBay, you can simply make an account. You can start listing winning products. Now, how to be successful is finding the right products to sell. I know so many people, I know too many people that mess with me every day and say, Josh, my products aren't selling. And that's because, and that's because your products that you're selling don't have a wow factor. You know, they don't stand out. They're probably easily found in stores because people can just go and search the product on Google. People can just go search the product on Google and drive and get the product instead of getting it delivered. All these factors, all these, your winning product formula is probably not as good as it should be, hence why you're not making any sales. Your dropshipping business model is going to be dead if you don't know what to sell and you don't know how to use, you know, the SEO, search engine optimization on eBay to get sales, to get views. Because if you ain't getting eyeballs, you ain't making sales. And that's something that I learned that you're gonna need the right guidance. At some point, you're gonna have to spend money on skills, on programs, on courses to get the right knowledge. Because simply, you can go onto YouTube if you wanted to. So the question is, do you want it to take 12 weeks or 12 years? That's kind of the question you've got to answer for yourself. Obviously, if you wanted, if you're young, you know, you have kind of that bit of a more risk oriented play, definitely worth it to get a mentor to kind of speed up your success. So I just want to clear that up. Drop shipping is never going to be dead. It's just the products that are going to be saturated, hence why they're going to die out over a period of time. Another reason why drop shipping is never going to be dead is that people are lazy. People don't want to go in stores. They don't want to do their research. They don't want to do their own due diligence. They're gonna simply go onto eBay, search up a product that they want. You've already listed it, so it's gonna show up, and then you're gonna buy it. It's gonna have that impulse buy. And what I mean by impulse buy is when you sell your products, you wanna be listing them between the $50 and $30 range. Nothing higher, nothing below, just to start out, because if you are a new seller, you probably don't have a lot of reviews. You probably haven't made much sales. So within that range, it's an impulse buy. And an impulse buy means that when a customer clicks on your listing, 
They're not gonna think like, oh, is this competitive? Is this product worth selling at this price? They're not gonna think about it like that. They're gonna buy it right away. That's why it's called an impulse buy. And that's super important to ensure that your dropshipping business model is never going to die. And what's crazy is I feel like the term where they say dropshipping is set has come from people that have been unsuccessful in the space. So they're probably like, you know what, I failed in the business, I've done it once, it hasn't worked out for me, therefore dropshipping's dead. That's probably the main reason why this kind of question, this kind of statement comes out, and that's because they're not consistent enough in business. In business, your products aren't gonna sell, you know, your website's gonna go down, your payment process is gonna go down, and that's why you gotta be consistent. Consistent at the right things, I've always said that, you probably know me by now, I'm saying consistent at the right things, not consistent at the wrong things, otherwise you ain't gonna get anywhere, right? So that's where I feel like this kind of term, this kind of scarcity that dropshipping is dead has come out. But do bear in mind, when people say dropshipping is dead, that could be a tactic to get people to not do dropshipping so they get more piece of the pie. I'm just saying, you never know. But yeah, with that being said, on that note, I hope I kind of cleared up this question for you. So the understand that dropshipping is not dead in 2023 moving forward and will for never ever be dead. Just the methods in the past, they're dead. That's why you gotta always be evolving your knowledge, getting to using the right skills, right ways to find products and everything like that because that's always changing in the industry every single day. Especially with AI now, it's gonna be a lot crazier. I'm sure you've heard about you know chat GPT and everything like that, that AI tool. Um, so the world is changing very quickly with AI and I wouldn't be surprised in the years to come, months to come, how much the dropshipping space is gonna change from artificial intelligence. So with that being said, that's it for this week's video. If you guys have video suggestions, drop them in the comments down below. If you did find some value here, if I did kind of clear up anything for you, please leave a like, it really helps out the channel. And yeah, if you haven't subscribed already, hit that sub button, we're on the way to 10,000 subscribers. So let's be a part of that, the OG 10K. And once we get the 10K, we're off to that 100K plaque. So that's it for the video, guys. I hope you found some value and I'll see you guys in the next video. And I do also hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Peace. Thank you.